Hello all and welcome back to Extension Cares. This is Tristan Cope, Marion County's 4-H and Family and Consumer Science Extension Agent. So today I wanted to share with you a few tips that I've learned about meal planning. Meal planning can be a great asset during this time when we are trying to limit the number of trips that we are taking to the grocery store. One way that I like to plan out my meals is by taking a sh blank sheet of paper and then folding it so I have eight squares. So I've pre-made my meal plans for this next week and things that I'm looking forward to eating. So on here I have Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, all the way down through Friday and Saturday. Then my last square that's empty, I use for my store list. So when I'd like to do this, I actually put down my lunches that I'm looking at having, as well as my suppers. Um, suppers can include your main meal entree, as well as any sides that you might like to eat. When we're looking at writing this list and making it, sometimes you notice that you won't have things that you need to go and pick up. This is where I use that store column. A few tips when you go to the supermarket or to your grocery store. This would be buying something in bulk. So maybe this means buying a container of oatmeal versus an instant kind. It could also mean making sure that we're sticking to our shelf stable or those items that can be stored in your refrigerator or your freezer. This way it can preserve longer and we're able to use it and not have to use it instantly. The last tip that I have for you today is to involve your kiddos. Have them choose something that they would like to eat one night a week or two nights a week. This could be a fun thing that they get to help in the evenings to plan out how they're gonna make that homemade pizza or how they're gonna make those sloppy joes for them to eat. Involving everyone in the family is always a fun way to make sure everyone's eating. I hope this has helped you guys in planning for your next store haul, as well as planning out your meals for this week and potentially next. I hope you have a great day.